Hey, good morning. This is Greg Peckman with the Peckman team at Hancock Mortgage. Hope everybody's having a great morning. Hope you had a great weekend. It's the week, I guess, before Christmas. So, wow, this year has flown by and uh, 2022 is coming upon us here. Obviously, inflation is a big news right now. Everybody's worried about that. Um, it's not stopping. It's gonna, it's increasing. So buying real estate, I, you know, hedges that for you. So uh, it's always a good a uh, good way to to really, hey, listen, I can get it to the market. I can still ride that uh, appreciation a little bit uh, and kind of offset that inflation a little bit, especially if you're buying investment properties because then you can gain cash flow. Cash flow is the key when it comes to investing, um, as everybody knows. So, uh, But anyway, um, real quick here, because this comes up from time to time. Um, you know, people want to buy uh, a home, go on conventional financing and keep it in the LLC and corporation. I totally get it. But the guideline is it has to be done under your name individually or a revocable trust. OK, so so just be aware of that. Um, you know, those are the two options there. Now, there's some times where you can, you know, switch it over to LLC after the fact. You, you know, there's some rules. Check with your lender. Check with your servicer. Uh, sometimes it you know, has to be 12 months living there um, and, and so forth. So th there's different caveats to it. Uh, definitely double check before you make that switch over to LLC but the note's still gonna be in your name personally, okay? Be aware of that, because if, if that is a problem, here's something to, to watch out for. If your current lender doesn't allow you to do that and you switch it, uh, let's say, you know, 12 months from now or six months from now or two years from now, whatever, uh, they can call the note on you. So just be very, very aware of that. Um, and, you know, just, just, just be, you know, definitely do your homework on the front end, okay? So hopefully that makes sense. Let me know if you have any questions on that. Uh, shoot me a comment down below, uh, shoot me a private message, or text me at 423-262-9229. Have a great Monday. Have a great week. I'll talk to you soon.